Every day, around the world, amazing discoveries are made about our past. It seems that what we thought impossible one day appears to be real, and the fossil remains of some animals show us that our wildest ideas were once a reality. Perhaps one of the most recent and incredible discoveries can be found in crocodiles, and not in just any crocodile, but in an unknown creature, originally from Tanzania, that now could have returned from prehistoric times to torment the inhabitants of the Philippines. If you'd like to find out what's at the bottom of this chilling story, then join us in this opportunity and get ready to meet the prehistoric crocodile that's killing people in the Philippines. Our journey through the creepy begins in 2016, just in the month of January, when Cretaceous Research magazine announced to its readers a surprising discovery in the Tanzanian desert. Apparently, a group of researchers had traveled to this location to track down a strange creature that was thought to be unreal. Some called it a prehistoric crocodile, while specialists referred to it as a chimria, a name given to creatures that seem unreal or taken from some text created by the unbridled imagination of a citizen of the past. However, the team managed to prove otherwise. In the excavation, the researchers found an ancient fossil, at least 30 feet long and 120 million years old. Upon closer examination, it became clear that this was a creature never seen before. A new species of reptile. In short, they had found Maximoceros rex, the largest crocodile ever to roam the earth. The discovery was surprising for the world of science, and studies on this new species of crocodile quickly began. However, what no one could have foreseen was that only two years later, thousands of miles away, unusual and bloody attacks by a creature that fit all the characteristics of Macmoserus rex began to be recorded. Reports of this event were made in the Philippine province of Agasan del Sur, a land of fishermen and small traders who knew virtually nothing of the discovery of Maximoceros rex, but were quite knowledgeable about the dangers of rivers and swamps. So when the disappearance of several local fishermen came to the attention of the police in the month of March 2018, many veterans feared that the person responsible for these events was hiding in the deep sea. Suspicions became reality as the disappearances increased and were related to people leaving port in the morning and never returning home during the night. As time passed, the attacks became more frequent. Within a short time, the number of victims increased to five men and one woman. This prompted all local conversations to focus on an explanation. Who could be attacking the fishermen? Could it be a sea creature? And most importantly, was something being overlooked? For weeks there was no news, but one hypothesis began to gain strength. The thing that is in Agasan del Sur had a very peculiar frame that many local inhabitants have tried to forget. This province was a place where Ernesto Lolong Conate, an important hunter, tried to catch a bloodthirsty beast that had been attacking local villages and was attributed with numerous murders. Ernesto died of a heart attack trying to capture the beast, although this didn't have much influence on the outcome. The crocodile was caught a few days later by Ernesto's team and several members of the local community. The crocodile was about 20 feet long and weighed over one ton. Its image was chilling, an authentic prehistoric beast. But the scariest thing was found inside, since there were limbs, bones, and human flesh in its stomach, which horrified the whole village and gave this province international fame as the cradle of mega reptiles. This powerful creature was baptized as the Lolong Crocodile in honors of the famous hunter who tried to catch it. However, it wasn't the first great monster in this area. Some local accounts describe many other crocodiles of equal or greater proportions hiding in the depths. Their presence has always generated an uneasy coexistence between fishermen and reptiles, but almost no one approached their habitats. However, from time to time, these beasts dared to invade the territory of the local citizens. Then many missing persons began to be reported and monstrous sightings of giant reptiles were recorded. This is what the community of Agasan del Sur was experiencing in 2018. 
After the first month of disappearances, everyone came to the same conclusion. The culprit could be none other than the descendant of the Lolong crocodile. Of course, they weren't wrong. Numerous local hunters tried to track down this mighty crocodile, but although they were unsuccessful in their mission, they managed to collect not only some sightings of the creature, but actual data on its dimensions. It's said that this creature measured more than 30 feet in length and easily weighed close to three tons. Its body was robust, covered with strong, rough scales. Its jaw was twice as wide as that of a conventional crocodile, and it's probably the most ferocious and chilling living reptile on the planet. The description caught the attention of researchers around the world. Was a real Macmoserus rex hiding in this Philippine province? Could it be captured alive? Or better yet, did it really exist? Sadly, all these questions remain without a solid answer. Although the disappearances have dwindled in Agasan del Sur, investigations are still open, and even different TV channels like Discovery UK have chosen this area to find out if Lovong's legacy is still alive or if it's just a legend. At the moment, there are very few things that can be known about the monstrous beast that keeps terrifying local fishermen and villagers, but one thing is certain, the monsters hiding in the depths could emerge at any time. In fact, they have already begun to do so. Across the length and breadth of our planet, sightings of unexplained creatures and sea monsters have been increasing as we have gained access to the technology needed to record what's happening around us. The cameras on our phones have managed to capture the image of the creepiest creatures you can imagine. And if you want to see for yourself, all you have to do is join us in the following videos.